Hey guys, welcome to the studio. Welcome to the vlog. These, these ships, it's, it's crazy how long they are, how big they are, how much they have on top of them. But all of this doesn't really matter today because today it's all about sitting in the studio, making music and even more importantly, listening to music. Today I'm going to try to listen to all of the remix competition entries. Over 300. I already I already listened to half of them today the other half and do a special track submit edition with only remix contest songs tell, tell me what it's like First of all, again, thanks to everyone participating in this remix contest. The quality is a lot better than in any other remix contest we've done before, so it's a lot harder for me to, to decide. I've listened to all of them once. I narrowed it now down to 26, and I'd like to present you five of them, just random five out of the last 26. Just play them to you so that you have a feel for what kind of music was submitted and maybe also learn a little to, to improve for your next song. The first one is by Robin Pfeiffer, John Sine Secrets Remix. And yeah, let's just listen to it. Very cool, very bassy and groovy, clubby works. Really like it. The only feedback would be to maybe process the vocals a little more. They sound still very dry and that makes them like separated from, from the entire mix. You need to embed them in there. They could be like, like to be louder actually, to make them more present and way more reverb actually but other than that that's like a cool club based kind of version that i really like <laughs> Also good tune, for my personal taste, a little like too too crowded, a little too too hectic, but we're not trying to find something that is something I like 100%, we're just trying to find the best remix. And this one is definitely among the last 26, really like it, congrats to Noisy House for getting to the top 26. The next one is by Bad Boom box and of course also a secret remix. I like it. It's very deep, it goes more into a melodic techno tech house direction. Drum groove is really nice. The synthesizer sound that pops up here and there is really, really good. I I just think after a drop, like it, it goes on a little too long with that or anything happening. So maybe a tiny bit more automation effects to keep like the, the beat kind of sections a little more interesting. For this kind of music, it has to be like that but just like random effects, maybe some self-recorded, whatever you can find, just put it in there, delay, reverb on top, a little bit of a cueing, and just like, like put them wherever you feel like the song didn't change for the past five to eight seconds, just, 
just to keep it interesting. Hard to articulate, don't enunciate, but I know you're waiting for it. Ooh, I just can't let it go, cause I don't know, ready to unemploy, oh. This one by Michael Cross, I like it because it's it's like changing the vibe entirely. It goes more into like a funky, ravey kind of direction. I'm just not that happy about the mixing. It's a little muddy in, in the mid frequencies and in the low end. There is um yeah, a little bit too much going on. Not not too many elements necessarily, but you need to EQ away certain frequencies if you have, for example, two, three elements that are in the same frequency spot. You have to make one of them the star of the show and pull down the other ones, but I like this approach. My secrets, my secrets, too dangerous to Really good, really like like that's that's good stuff. Epic, I like it. Like that's good, really. <laughs> Almost nothing to complain. Like I'm not a huge fan about how the vocals were processed, but at least they got some processing and and he tried to change them up. The drop is really nice. Like the elements, the mixing is good. It's not too full, not too empty. Yeah, this one is ready like for, for mastering and then, then you gotta release. So congrats to Casper for making this amazing remix. Let's do one more. This one is by Jeremy. He already actually won or was one of the winner of the last remix competition of Stay. And he's he's again among the top. Let's listen to it. It's chill, piano, deep house. I just can't let it go. Reason unknown, ready to implode. Simple but solid. Everything is there that you need. I like the vibe. Mixing is good. He figured out like his his style. And yeah, those are those are five out of 26. I'll link them down below if you want to go check them out. Let me know in the comments which one of them you like best. I'm really having a tough time to decide, but I'll try to make a call like this week or at the very, very beginning of next week. I know a lot of you are excited, but I want to be able to go through all of them, listen to them on big speakers. And this um, takes quite some time. So uh, yeah, I'll now just go back to music production, working on, I can't already tell you like the name of the song, it's called Ashes, but the contract isn't signed yet. So I can't share with you my working process, but this will be a, a huge one. I love it. Like, I think that's the strongest one out of all of the album songs. And don't forget, check out my sample pack. There is another one, version number three. The first one was released on Splice. The second one on my website, the third one as well. It's full with Serum presets. Like all of the sounds I've used in my album are all included in there. First link in the description. Thanks a lot for watching. With you, yes. With you.